Hi, my name is Malcolm and I'm a PSLE Science Specialist here at the Pig Lab. Welcome to another episode of PSLE Science Made Simple. In this video, I'll be going through a past year examination question on the topic of heat energy. I have also prepared this question for you to download for free by clicking a link in the description box below. So, let's get started. Question 24. In cold countries, houses have windows that are constructed using two pieces of glass panes as shown below. Which one of the following shows how the windows keep the house warm even on a cold day? Ah, I know what some of you must be thinking. Since the window above is made of glass, which is a poor conductor of heat, you will choose your answer as option 4. But option 4 is actually wrong. The question here is why? From the diagram, we can see that there is an airspace that gets trapped between the two glass pieces. Now, when we take a look at the two glass pieces, we have an inner glass and an outer glass. Now, where can the inner glass be found? Would the inner glass be found inside or outside the house? Yes, as the name suggests, the inner glass will be found inside the house. Now, what about the outer glass? The opposite must be true for the outer glass. The outer glass must be found outside the house. So let's write that down. Now, in cold countries, which part of the house will be colder? Would it be the inside or the outside of the house? Yes, it will be the outside of the house that is cooler, which means the inside of the house would be warmer instead. Now, after some time, what is going to happen to the house? Is the house going to become warmer or colder? Yes, in cold countries, the house is going to become colder. So, this tells us that the inside of the house, is it going to be gaining heat or losing heat? Yes, the inside of the house must be losing heat to the cooler air outside the house. The question here is why? Remember, what is the property of heat? Heat always travels from a warmer region to a cooler region. Now, taking a look at this diagram, where is the warmer region? The warmer region is inside the house. So, we know that heat is going to travel from the inside of the house to the outside of the house, which is cooler. Okay, so this is how heat is going to travel. But looking at the diagram, what does the heat pass through? Yes, we can see the heat is able to pass through the glass. But is it only passing through the glass? No, the heat can also pass through the airspace. So we know that the air must somehow be able to keep the house warm even on a cold day. So in order to do that, must the air conduct the heat from the inside to the outside faster or slower? Yes, so we can write down that the air is able to conduct heat slower. Now, since air conducts heat slower, what does this tell us about the property of air? Is air a good or a poor conductor of heat? Yes, from this we can tell that air is a poor conductor of heat. And that is the reason why houses in cold countries have two glass pieces as their windows because this would allow air to be trapped. And we know that air is a poor conductor of heat. So this will reduce the rate of heat loss from the inside to the outside of the house, keeping the inside of the house warm. Now with this understanding, we are ready to look at the question. So before looking at the options, let's erase everything we have written before. And let's recall, which material is responsible for keeping the house warm? Is it glass or air? 
Yes, it is air. And this is because air is a poor conductor of heat and would conduct heat faster or slower. Yes, it will conduct heat slower. So the correct answer should be option three. Thank you for watching. I hope you have enjoyed this video. If you found this video useful, do give us a thumbs up. If you'd like to check out more videos by us, do click on the links on the right hand side. Last but not least, don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more interesting videos. Thank you and I'll see you guys next time. Bye!